It's likely to be one of the biggest single issues in the upcoming federal election here in the South Okanagan West Kootenai, and that's crime and public safety. Conservative candidate Helena Conans and the party's deputy shadow minister for public safety is touring the region today, talking to the residents about that problem. Alberta MP and former Medicine Hat police officer Glenn Motts spoke to a small group of Penticton voters and media Monday morning before holding a similar event in Oliver. Motts spoke about the need to address the root causes of crime like mental health and addictions issues. That's something candidate Helena Conans said has seen some success in Penticton with the recent opening of the Foundry Youth Centre. It's really positive that's happened in this community and that was, that was with the um, youth coming up and saying we need this because of, especially because of all the suicides that have happened in the last few years in this community. With local police openly frustrated with repeatedly arresting the same prolific offenders over and over, Mott said bailing Canada needs an overhaul. There comes a time when an offender needs to be held accountable and they need to be, if, if they continue to commit offenses uh, while they're out on bail, then you need to hold them in custody until their trial. And guess what? When they're in custody, they're not committing more property offenses. He wasn't able to specify any legislation a Conservative government would bring in to reform the bail process. Most in the room acknowledged more resources for mental health and addiction resources are needed, but the billion dollar question remains, how to pay for it without increasing taxes. Government gives millions, hundreds of millions of dollars a year away to, to groups across the country to, to deal with the things we've been talking about today with virtually no accountability. We can actually build into our systems uh, accountability, not, not to the point of we stymie the agencies to do the work that they have to do so much accounting back to their funding source, which is important to do, but they actually have to show results. Yeah. And I've, I've wondered that many times. What, what results are we getting for anything we give our money to? The federal election is 10 weeks away. For Castanet in Penticton, I'm Colin Dacre.